To other stories now. A young Nigerian woman, Fumi Oyatogun, is celebrating Africans and putting them on the world map. She has created a card game called Fill in the Black, aimed at spreading information about black people and highlights their positive impact globally. Imi John Mekwa reports for Just Nigeria. Fill in the Black is a card game created to broaden knowledge on the black nation. With chants such as Black Lives Matter and stories of violence against African Americans, it's a necessity to put more information on the continent, its people and achievements out there. <laughs> this, Fumio Yatogun says, motivated the creation of the game. It's a very simple game. Um, it's a game that many of it's a style of games that many of us are very familiar with. It's a pantomime game or guessing game. There is a word on the card and then there are five smaller words. So those smaller words are the forbidden words. They are the obvious words that come to mind when you think of the big word. Now it is your role as a member of a team to describe the big word to your team without using any of the smaller forbidden words because naturally those are the words that will come to your mind. But I've noticed that people describe visa so differently depending on the context that they're in and this goes back to us telling different black stories. So somebody who lives in Canada or lives in the US or lives in Sweden would, would see the word visa and the first thing that would come to mind is the credit card company. But somebody who lives in Nigeria or Kenya or Cameroon will see the word visa and the first thing that comes to mind is that it's the, it's the stamp that they need to be able to travel to another country and it's one word. The game also tries to highlight individuals who have placed the continent in good light and I just had to try it out. Okay, so there is a word. I'm not going to say the word, so you're going to try to guess it. Okay, so she's one of our most popular celebrities from this country. She currently lives in Trump's country. Um, she is a literary icon. Amanda. Yes, Chimamanda Adichie. So I obviously had to try to describe it without saying the word Nigerian or feminist or author or Americana or single story because those are the things that she's most known for. So I had to find other ways to describe Chimamanda so playing a card game doesn't just have to be for fun. It can also be for education purposes. It could be for exploring. And in this case, it is for open up the black world to the other parts of the world. I'm Ili John Mekwa reporting for GIST Nigeria. Kudos for me for celebrating the black race.